Welcome back everybody, my name is Gillian, and we're going to take a look at Neverwinter Nights 2, compare them a little bit between 1 and 2, and the Enhanced Edition. I'm going to be doing the beginning part, so character creation, and like the first bit of the campaign, just to see how they look and how they feel versus Neverwinter Nights 1 Enhanced Edition. Now, I'm not the best at editing, so if I can do a side-by-side -side comparison somehow with some, like, slice effect, I'm going to try. Let's see what happens. Uh, let's go to the original campaign. Okay. Plane touched. So their graphics are a little bit smoother, but they still look flat to me personally. Okay. I mean, they're a little bit smoother here and there. At least that's my beginning, like. Impression. I haven't played this since, God, probably 2010, 2012, I want to say. So it's been like six years. Okay. You do get the different elf races. Okay. Let's see, which one is the... I mean, there's the drow. I can do drow. I'm thinking I'm going to do a non-magic -ma race. That, or I can play a wizard, since I've never played a wizard before. What's there? Fair cost ranger. Wizard. Wizard. Yeah, you have adjustment plus two. Okay. Let's go to the sun elf. Let's see what happens there. And I might... Ah, oh God. I've always, I've always done magic classes. No. You know what? I'm going to do a moon elf. I'm going to do a ranger. I'm going to do, a like, a... Girth. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's go skin color. That's pretty. Hmm. Hair. Let's see. Oh, let's not go crazy. That's cute. Like a little flower. Uh, eye color. Let's go with the nice blue hair color. Hair highlight. Oh. Interesting. Cool. Hair accessory. Oh, that's a flower. A lot of blue. Spirit shaman, swashbuckler. Uh, they have the other <laughs> frenzy berserker. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay. Let's go to the ranger. Fruits of real effects are high. Her will is going to be low. I do apologize. I'm coming down with a cold or something. Uh, 
Okay. Oh dear. Okay. Let's go with neutral, because that's always fun. Okay, this is where you do pick a god to worship. Uh, where's the goddess of magic? Good and profile, good and neutral, Lanthrocrypts, moon navigation, quest stars, and wanderers. Eh. Uh, let's see. Talos? Talos? Oh, that's right, Talos. Ooh. Siloon's always one. There's magic. Hmm. Huh. Mother of Illusions. Liera. The Garden of Liars, Lady of Mist, Lady of Deception, the Mist Shadow, the Mist Maiden, Mother of Illusionists. Ooh. I'll, I'll go with her. Okay, so. For Rangers, they need a high dexterity, because she's going to be a ranged ranger. Like an actual, like, archer. Uh. Okay, that should be okay. Oh, so two more points. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, background. Uh, wild child. Tale teller. Militia. I suppose say farmer, devote, bully, veteran, praiser. Troublemaker. Hmm. Uh, let's see. I'm probably going to go with a razor on because money. Yeah, plus two appraise, plus one lore. We're going to do this. Do hi. Hide. Listen. Move silently. Let's uh, do with lore to search. Uh, survival. Spot. And two different I can do craft later. Oh, that's right. Uh, dragons, elves, fey, giants, gnomes, humanoids, halflings, humans, humanoid monsters. Hmm. Hmm. She's probably going to be a monster hunter. Elves, colonists, gnomes, giants, fey. Hmm. 
Luscious humanoids, I think. Okay. Dodge. Dash. Come expertise. Monkey grip. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, they actually break them up for you. Background traits. Artist. Blooded. Oh, oh, these are the only the ones you could take at first level. One of her body. Bonus hit points. Ooh. Ooh, that'd be nice. Like if heroes plus one. Honestly, it was, it was a plus one. Luck bonus armor class. Oh. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, lucky heroes. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. Hello? Is my sound not working? Hold on, give me one sec. Okay, there we go. For some reason, my ah, game audio stopped. Hmm. I see them. Ugh. There are enemies here at my command. Attack! Hmm. Get them! Kick uh. some ass! All right, crew. Let's take them down. Hmm. Sultry. Attack! Oh, I think this one wants to play. Eh. Fiery. Let's attack! Time to knock some sense into the- Attack! Maiden. To arms! Feel my sting! Hmm. No time for talking. Let's get to the action! Hmm. We have no choice. Surrender! All right, crew. Let's take them down. Yeah, let's go with- Playful. So many years ago today. Hmm. Ah, my foster daughter is up and dressed, I see. Today is the High Harvest Fair, and the West Harbor Village Council requires me to man the archery competition. The human need to celebrate Remembrance Days baffles me, but at least something productive may come of it. The merchant Galen is here. You want my furs, as he usually does. Coins can be useful in getting by. This past season has been a hard one for both tilled fields <laughs> and wildlands. While I attend to the archery contest, I will need you to deal with the merchant. Fetch my furs from the chest. Over by the painting. Okay. Ah, never mind. It's two. Let's see what pop ups. Whoa, whoa. Good. I see you have the furs. Galen has probably set up his tent on the village green. He'll be enjoying the fair with the rest of the townsfolk. Last season, I asked him to bring a duskwood bow to trade. Sell him the furs and use the coins it gives you to purchase the bow. Your friends await you at the bridge. I suppose you're <laughs> anxious to see the fair. But don't forget to trade with Galen. Okay. So my hit points are up there. Nine hit points, not bad. Okay, let me see if I can adjust this a little bit. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Oh, that's low light vision. Okay, you can actually turn that on and off. Okay. The, it's it's it feels less shiny than Evernight's one, but it still feels like it's about like it's just a little ahead of Evernight's one. Evernight's two feels a little bit just a little bit ahead. It feels a little more like matte finish versus shiny. There Bebe. you are. Come on, the fair's already started. It's the biggest fair in years. There's folk in from all the outlying farms, and even a few from outside the mayor. That means a big audience. A big audience, all cheering for us. This year's our last chance to compete for the Harvest Cup. Our last <laughs> chance to win. I remember this. The Mossfelds won both their matches in the Harvest Brawl. They'll be tough to beat, but Amy's bound to win the tourney of talent for us. I convinced Tarmus to teach me a few new spells. And I dug up a couple more from his spell books when Aww. he wasn't looking. Anyway, I heard Will Mossfeld is doing the same act this year, so that should help my chances. Oh, gods. Not the pixie impressions again. We sign up with Georg in the village square. Come on! Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, you got a lot more companions. That's right. You should get a, a legit party. Third edition, I think. So you've decided to compete for the cup, uh. I see. I know this is your last year, but the rules apply to all, even foster daughters. <laughs> a fine bow, a fine one, hmm. made by one who loves his craft. You may keep the rest of the gold as your allowance for the season. But you came for the archery competition as well, did you not? Fetch a crossbow from the barrel and take a few shots at the practice target. You must hit the target once before you can compete. Yay! Yes, indeed. Yes? There you go. Are you ready to compete then? Yes. The rules are the same as last year. Ten shots and ten targets. Your targets will be old bottles set atop the crates yonder. Five is the best score so far. If you remember the lessons that have been taught to you, you should be able to best that. <laughs> This is too easy. <laughs> so I, let's see. If I roll a three, I hit it. The effects are definitely a lot nicer. The shadows, eh. This is too easy. It's definitely a lot softer looking than the first Never Nights, which There's was very sharp. That came from. Well done. A perfect score wins the competition outright. I've rarely seen such a fine performance so early in the day. You have a marksman's instinct. That much is plain. Go oh. on now, there's still more of the fair to see. Aw, no more.
Enjoying the fair? Packs of feral children selling <laughs> fine trinkets. Grown men braining one another with clubs. Oh, you it. know they're actually granting prizes for the fattest pig. <sighs> as if the creatures needed encouragement. Uh... I expect you are here for the aptly named Knave's Challenge. Surrounded by muck and reek, and why not encourage our children to be thieves as well? Oh, chill. That's what I always tell them. Come to think of it, I don't believe any of you has the skills to compete. Not that I'm complaining, mind you, but you'll need to find someone who can pick pockets and break locks and search for hidden trinkets if you want to compete. Lock breakers? Pocket pickers? I don't know anyone like that. Do you? What about Kip? He's always nicking vials from Tarmus, and he's right over there behind the tent. Hmm. During drills, I get hit by acorns. Isn't that the boy who stole my basilisk eyelash? And not once, but four times. That's right. My frog needed eyelashes. Then I got him a sweetheart, and she needed him too. <sighs> Don't trouble yourself on my account. I'll settle with the young artiste and his frog later. <laughs> Before you begin, I suppose you'll want to hear the rhyme. Very well, but it's dreadful. Don't say I didn't warn you. <clears throat> I love it. I've hidden three feathers, scattered them wide, placed white in a box, and locked it inside. Blue followed termite tracks down where they ran, green in the pocket of same colored man. Yes, you and half the waifs in West Harbor. I adore children, did you know that? Swamp children, particularly. Uh. Ah. White in a box. Okay. Oh, I l the voice acting is another thing that's really good. Wood pile. Okay. I like it. Blue feather, nice. A locked chest and a dude wearing green. Somewhere. Nice. I like how you can take control of other party members in Never Ends 2. Gives you a little bit more control when it comes to strategy and stuff like that. If they could implement a little more, I guess, control in Never Nights 1, that or hell, even just update some of the, the ways you can order them around. It really is a dreadful day for a fair. Not even the tents are managing to look cheerful. Thank the gods. The knaves... I'd kiss all of you, but no one respects an affectionate wizard. <laughs> no need to remind me. I try never to leave my home unless I'm looking for a bath. 
Oh, but look, am I taking a child with me? Yes. She's a ranger rogue. Awesome. Okay. Who do I go to next? You get a winning for me? Of course, juggling, juggling and puppetry are well and good, but the children want to see magic and so do I. Excuse my stomach, I know, but it's just kids watching, right? Yeah, you can do this. Oh. What is he? It's a bat. Enlargement spell? How do I access her spell book? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's cute. Magic young and me more than passing simple if you ask me though I know you, I know you didn't. How familiar is a bat, apparently. Well, Orland's right. This pig's been enchanted. It's a faint aura, so it could have been a simple enlargement spell, or maybe a potion. Well, Retta did give us a scroll. Wait a minute. Uh, shouldn't we say he's a foul old wretch? But we ought to give him a chance to withdraw his pig from the contest before he's shamed in front of everyone. Hmm. <laughs> Speak about how in the contest. Ah, I don't learn that I'm no cheat. Your pants. Ah. Okay. I. Yes. 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 Let's see. Let's do the spell. Oh, it's tiny. Yes. I love it. Okay. Orlin. Where's Orlin? Expression on that hog's face. I was a bit the big poker loading over his spirits, but now he's probably just poisoned himself. Uh. <laughs> it's pork jerky. Thanks. Oh, kill it wounds. 
I mean, that'll be nice. Uh, even a brawl. He has, uh, he has likes you, Harperman. I think. The humor. Many cuts in setting bones right now. <laughs> Let me change what I feel that morning bird and I really see equal equal as strangers. Ready to fight. Dummies over there. Once you finish off a dummy, I'll send you into the ring. Training club, uh, several clubs in the brow here next to me. Okay. One to him. Oh yeah, minus five, minus nine. Yeah, that's not gonna hit me. Plus one. There's the training dummies. Oh, they're here. They're there. What's up? Plus four. I think he Bring should do it. To it. Me. Jeez. Uh. Go ahead. You the attacks only know uh, arrows or magic. You may fight barehanded or you may arm yourself with a training club. Choice is yours. Ah uh -huh. She want to be able to be fair. Ah, that my word. Yes. I can do that. There's more where that came from. Take a lot to chew. Sneak attack. Okay, I'll I'll work with that. I'll throw a few, but I feel the gods have granted you a few. I'm the only team in con still contention. Look at this, but everyone's fair for the Raw looking to beat the champs of three years running. Always tagging it to Starlings. Make blood fly. Let's do some plots and raise sticks, make a funny wager. I don't trust you to pay up. I think I spy some unsuspecting playmates ahead. <laughs> I wonder, what's his taunt then? This 
Yay! Yes. Hold well on, all three of them. The times will compare you to Corbic and the two aren't mistaken. Harvest Brawl. Yes? Ah, oh, a healing cat. Okay. Mm. Yes. Okay. What's the last competition? Wave challenge. Oh, talent show. Where's the talent show? Harvest Mead. How last year? Uh, maybe we better go. And that vulgar song, not this year, but on your way now. Swinging hips. Uh, she's blushing. Look at her cheeks go red. You two told me you'd made that up. I think you're planning. To, knowing this town, you're probably right. That's fucking adorable. Okay, let me just finish this part up, and I think that's gonna be it for Never Tonight 2. We'll do a, a comparison now and again. Gather round, mates! Gather round! This harvest fair is a celebration, but it's also a dark anniversary. We all know what else happened on this day. Hmm? Not so long ago, we nearly lost this village, almost lost our lives. Almost lost it all, but we came back, cleared burnt farms, buried our dead, and put our ashes behind us. Aww. And we rebuilt, tougher and stronger than ever. Long as there's a harvest fair, we won't forget that day. And our young folks, they'll stay tough, long as they compete for the Harvest Cup. So <laughs> let's hear it for this year's winners. Three cheers for the Harvest Champions. Hip, hip. Hooray! Hip hip hooray! This is actually really adorable. Hip hip hooray! Aw, oh, High Harvest Fair. That's cool. The village is under attack! West Harbor is under attack! Oh boy. We're safe! Grab a weapon! We need to help defend the village! What's going on? I'm not sure. They came pouring in from the swamp and started tearing the village apart. We better hurry. I saw some of them following us on our way here. They're likely to hit this house next. It's in that chest. Hurry up and arm yourself. Okay. Oh boy. Great dwarves. Gosh, there's a lot of bonuses. No equipment. I think I spy some unsuspecting playmates ahead. Okay, okay, that remains sparkle. I like that. Yeah. 
yes. A longbow. Okay. Okay, so that's where I'm going to leave it here for right now. Definitely a big difference between 1 and 2. Like a big improvement over general systems. I still like number one, the one oh, butt ton. 2, I don't know, the writing system is a little bit less. But that's just my personal opinion. Once again, my name is Kewton. This has been Never Do Nights 2. And I'll see everyone later.